<laughs> I am not an Indian. Um, well, because I'm not. <laughs> um, I'm OG Cree from Manitoba originally, and that's what I am. I'm not an Indian. But to us, that term is archaic and racist. Um, and yeah, it's just not correct. So that's why I picked it as the face of the show. And it's just pretty blatant and obvious with the intent. And then um, there's a lot of stuff tied into the Indian name, but my, my own work is representing who I really am. That's what it means. Um, this mural piece was an opportunity, and I seized it with that idea, because that was one thing that I always wanted to touch on, was the politics and how it changed our people and our lives as, as a nation. And ever since that act came out, it was, it, it's just basically um, the sum of why we are the way we are today. And that was important to showcase. I think our people are fed up and they're tired. Um, we faced so much um, criticism and unfair judgment based on our predisposition. And whenever something happens to another to us again, it's like, oh, what now? What more do you want now? And that's what they're saying is we're tired of constantly being overlooked and unaccommodated because of something, a misunderstanding or a, a political view. And we're just tired. There's the, the pipelines, yeah, and there's the social justice system with Tina Fontaine and all these kids that are dying. There's a CFS system that fails kids every day. And then you got the Indian Act, which covers all of that. And all our people are trying to do is just speak out because we have that attention now. The media does pay attention. I don't know if they have much sway on um, if they're interested or not, or if it's just a hot topic right now. But I think honestly, our people are making it's a movement and we're actually educating ourselves and becoming more involved with it more than ever. That's what I've seen so far.